Today I am reviewing Sonic Unleashed, the game that everybody seems to be liking nowadays. In my opinion, I think this is the best Sonic game in the entire franchise, and I will tell you why. First off, let's talk about the gameplay. The gameplay is incredible. You got the daytime stages and the nighttime stages. First off, the daytime stages are incredible. Fast paced, amazing platforming levels. They never get tiring. They're so fun. And Sonic's boost formula is the best in the series. Way better than forces in any other game. That's, of course, bad. Now let's talk about the controversy between the Werehog stages, the nighttime stages. Uh, in my opinion, I think they are pretty good. Not only is the combat great, but you can also run as a Werehog, which is pretty nice. It doesn't get really redundant. It can get a little redundant in some levels, but I appreciate what they were going for for this. It's definitely more, you know, different than just running and doing the same thing, you know? It changes it up a little bit, and I like it. And then we gotta talk about the music. Oh man, the music! It is phenomenal. One of the best in the franchise, probably the best in the franchise. It's just oh, so good. You never get tired of that amazing Werehog music. It sounds like it was made up in Cuphead, bro. And then you have the writing, the story. Jason Griffin doing the greatest and best voice acting for Sonic he has possibly done in the whole series of franchise of Sonic. Man, it's so good. And then we have the final bit. <sighs> the IGN game. Now, I'm going to be reviewing and inspecting this review. I've heard rumors that it was dog shit and I'm going to be reviewing it myself. So let me take a close look at this review real quick. There's one thing you should know about Sonic Unleashed before spending your hard-earned money on it. It's a big piece of garbage. Big piece of garbage. Damn, he fucking hates this game. That should probably be enough to warn off anybody who's thinking about playing it, but I guess we should talk a little bit more about it just in case you like to hear this tortured sound of my voice. Jesus fucking Christ, he's acting like the fucking game ruined him. Indeed, it's games like this that make reviewers rethink their lives. Yeah, becoming better reviewers. Now, I have a theory when it comes to Sonic games. Someone at Sega hates the Hedgehog with all his might, and he's going about trying to sabotage the franchise with these awful games. Okay, I think I had enough of this review for now. Now, let's see what they gave this game on their website. IGN, what the fuck were you on making this review? This game deserves a 10 out of 10. It's a masterpiece. 